Hey guys, it's the DIY girl's guy's daughter. <laughs> I don't say girls. Um, so today what we're going to be making is a pinhole camera because I have to make one for school and I asked the DIY guy if he could help me out. <laughs> we took a regular old shoe box and uh, it was already loose around the end so we put some duct tape to make sure that that was all sealed and then we spray painted inside and out a flat black so you can see it's spray painted all the way inside and there's the lid right there and so it's all been spray painted black and with the tape we actually get a better seal on the lid so as we come back you can take a look at that it sits down in there and that makes it nice and and a uh, light tight. Pinhole camera, you need some sort of aluminum piece that'll act as the, the lens. So what we're going to do is, uh, you can use tin foil, but we want to go ahead and use an aluminum can. So I had a really good idea. Um, we have no empty cans, so he's like, Rochelle, why don't you just chug a whole thing of Fresca so we can use this aluminum can? So uh, that's what I'm trying to do right now. <laughs> After I finished drinking it, we cut it open and we cut out a little uh, square piece of the can and we taped it to the inside to the very center and then we put a tiny pinhole <laughs> through the aluminum and then it looks like this. And that's where the you can make the picture. All right, so now what we're going to do is we're going to make the shutter because that's how the picture is going to be created. So we're going to cut out a piece of cardboard. Where is our paper? That's in your bedroom. Okay, so we're going to cut out a piece of cardboard paper, tape it to the top, and put it over so that when I go to take a picture, I can just pull up the construction paper, leave it open for like 30 seconds, and then close it back up, and then go in a dark room and develop. All right, so here's the final product. So the little lens cover is right here. You just pull that up, and then it exposes the pinhole. You hold it open for 30 seconds. After you put the film stock in the back, you get the exposure, you close it, you seal it back up with the rubber band, and you take it to a dark room and you develop it. There it is. Took all in all, it probably took about 20 minutes to make, maybe a half an hour. And uh, there you go. Small pinhole camera. Don't forget to like and subscribe.